Blue Cut Fire in San Bernardino County has been out now for more than a week. But KCOM 9's Andrea Fujii tells us for families who lost everything, their struggles are just beginning. It's the only light this Phelan family has for nine people who are now living in this small abandoned home after their homes burned in the Blue Cut Fire. We need almost everything to replace what was there and to start everything over. Emily and Sean, who don't want to share their last name, have a newborn and two-year-old son with autism and are now raising them without running water or electricity. There's no wiring in the walls. There's no solar panels left. There's no batteries left. There's, there's nothing. They didn't have homeowner's insurance, so for the past two weeks have come to Mayola's in Phelan, an animal rescue that's now turned into a human rescue, picking up donated clothing, food, and home goods. All right, let's get the batteries. Founder Ann Klein says they've helped nearly 30 families, and most didn't have insurance and no money to rebuild. To get their solar back, to get their water back, to it's uh, it's it's changed my life to see the needs that are out there. The 58 square mile blue cut fire burned 100 homes, but families say it also destroyed livelihoods, including Sean's equipment for his contracting business. But he says he's thankful no one was hurt. We're still here. We're all together. They say the county and Red Cross have helped, but to someone who's lost everything, it's just not enough. Donations are coming in to Mayola's, but organizers say more will continue to be needed. In the meantime, this family says they must put on a happy face. You got to be strong for your kids, and you got to lead by example, you know. So that's what we're trying to do. In Phelan, Andrea Fujii, KCAL 9 News.